You are about to join us on an adventure. My name is Winger Wedgie, intrepid explorer, former marine, Bible lover, and friend to animals everywhere. I've traveled the four corners of the globe, climbed mountains, forged rivers, and faced countless dangers to bring you the world's most interesting creatures. This is Quitter Kingdom. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. You like to move it. And welcome back to Quitter Kingdom. You all know me, your host, Wanger Wedgie, and this is our last time aboard the Safari Express. <laughs> well, to make our last whistle stop, we thought we would find the holiest place we could. So we are going to the holy land of Israel. There it is. Can you say Israel? Very nice. Israel is nestled right in the middle of the Middle East. And it is a beautiful country full of lovely creatures. And as you know, every week we look for a special creature, one that touches our hearts and helps us tell our story. And what do we call it? Creature Feature! I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. You like to move it. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. Well, let's see if Handsome has today's Creature Feature Clue. Handsome, there you are, all dressed up for Israel. Very nice. Handsome, do you know today's Creature Feature Clue? What is it? Oh, a blanket? Okay, well, thank you. A blanket? I know what this is. This is the kind of blanket that donkeys wear. Oh, yeah, and there's a donkey right now. <laughs> Wow, <laughs> he's a real beauty. Wow, well, that must be the creature of the day, the donkey. Well, you know what? There was a lot of donkeys in the Bible. And fortunately, I have a friend who's going to bring me a donkey. She's our old friend. She's back from her mission trip. Do you guys want to help me call Rosa Winda? Let's give her a call. Oh, Rosa Winda. Help. Campos, hello, Angel Wendy. Hello, Rosa Wendy. It's so good to have you back. How was your trip? It was excellent. We got to teach Native American children all about the love of Jesus. Oh, well, you know, that's what we're about at Camp Venture. We're all about teaching children all about Jesus. Now, uh, Rosa Wendy, weren't you supposed to bring me a donkey? I mean, how are we going to teach about donkeys if we don't have one? <laughs> Never fear, Angel Wedgie. I asked one of your old friends to bring his donkey. Oh, I don't know them coming. Oh, no. I'm Lady Wall, here I is, here I is. Oh. <laughs> and here I brought my pet donkey. His name is Mr. Glitterpuss. Mr. Glitterpuss. Well, good to see you, Wyoming. I'm oh, glad did, did, you did. came and brought Mr. Glitterpuss. Well, we do have a, a donkey, and we do have a story with a donkey in it. However, there's a lot of stories with donkeys in it, so you can help us tell this one. Okay. This is the most famous parable in the Bible. Let me get the Bible out right now. <laughs> The Parable of the Good Samaritan. Ooh. Now, this story takes place between two cities. So, Rosa Winder, I want you to tie one end of this rope to that pole over there. And this pole will represent the first city. The first city is Jerusalem. Ooh, Jerusalem, right. okay. And Wyoming, over there? You, you take this end okay. and tie it around that last pole over there. Oh, okay. Yeah. And that is going to represent the city of Jericho. Okay. Oh, right. Ranger Wedgie, yeah. oh, what about this pole? Oh, that pole will represent the spot right in the middle between the two places. All right. Now, this story has a lot of characters oh, in it. Oh, yeah, so why don't you go ahead and pick some of the kids to help you out with this That's story. a good idea. Okay, I need four volunteers. I need some first graders. Where's your hand if you're in first grade? First grade? First okay. grade? Right over here, Abby. All right. Wait. And you back there. And maybe a boy. Do we have any boys in first grade? No boys? Oh, wait back okay, there. Okay, boy. come on up. Hello, hello. All right, let me get three first graders. And I need a fifth grader. Do we have any fifth graders who can help? Yeah. Okay, well, all right. Come on up. There we go, Josh. Good job. Put this on all right, now. Let me go. 
Josh is bigger than the other two. Very nice. So the other three. Yeah, okay, okay. You guys are the Wabas, so put okay. on your Wabba mask. The one over good. There. Yeah, very, very good. nice. All right. right here. All right, now you're the big fifth grader, Josh, so you're going to be the one who gets hurt. Ooh. All right, good. <laughs> All right. Sorry. All right, Sorry. here we go. Oh, shh. Jesus said a man was going down from Jerusalem to Jericho okay. when he fell into the hands of wobbers. Ooh. And they stripped him of his clothes, beat him, and went away, leaving him half dead. Oh, no. All right, we'll go ahead and on over here. Right, go ahead and down. lay down right way over down. here. You're going to be half dead. dead All right, right, come on over go. here, you wobbers. Here's Step a little on blanket for you, poor little hurt man. There you Aww. go. Oh, I'm so oh, sorry. But that's okay. They're going to stay over here with me. These three little robbers right on over here. Oh, right, and then brother. he's going to lay there, the hurt man. Oh, poor little hurt man. Oh, he looks oh. half dead. But I wonder what happened next. All right. Well, the Bible says next, a priest came by. Ooh, a priest. Okay. There Let's get their little priest hat over here. There we go. Which one going to be the priest? Here you go. That's so cute. Oh, that? right. Good. The priest came by, but when they saw the man... Walked by and passed by on the other side. Ooh, keep moving along now, preacher man. All right, good. Now, so too a Levite came by. Ooh, but we're going to need a Levite. All right, very good. You're going to get this shiny hat right here. Right. So you want to be the Levite? All right, very good. Take off the mask for me. And, ooh, got a little stuck right there. Hold on. Down the hair. Very good. All right, very nice. And here's your nice shiny hat, Levite. All right. Very good. So too a Levite when came by to the place and saw him, but passed by on the other side. Ooh, nothing to see here. Keep moving on along, very not. Well, the priest and Levite weren't much help where they was at Wenda. Mm -hmm. No, so you guys can have a seat. All Let's right. give them a round of applause. Give them a little round Thank of applause. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Yes. Very good. Right. Now, we still need someone who can help this little guy on the ground. Ooh, well, I think it's this fella right on over here. You're going to be the Samaritan, okay? So let's take off the mat, and you get that. Ooh, you got it. He knows the Samaritan hat. He was born wow, for this. Good. Very good. This is our Samaritan. But a Samaritan, as he traveled, came where the man was, and when he saw him, he took pity on him. Mm. He went to him and bandaged his wounds. Okay, That's so go it. ahead. And he had a little wound right there. That's okay. He bandaged a little his kissy. wounds, and he poured on oil <laughs> and wine. <laughs> and then he put the man on his own donkey, took him to an inn, and took care of him. All right, so go ahead on over to the innkeeper over here. No, you're still the Samaritan. Very nice. He was riding on the donkey. Ooh, be careful with the donkey. He's nice. Okay. Oh, careful, careful. There we go. And now we're going to have to pay the innkeeper. The next day, he took out two silver coins and gave them to the innkeeper. Look after him, he said, and when I return, I will reimburse you for any extra expense you may have. Well, thanks for staying at the Samaritan Inn. Great job, fellas. Let's give them a round of applause. Very nice. Very nice. Very Thank you nice very job. much. Watch your step. And you may hear me down, down Josh. Very Watch good. your step. Thank you, Ian. Watch your step. Thank you. Good. All right. Now, I want to ask you, you kids the question that Jesus asked okay. to the Shh. disciples right after he told the story. Shh. Listen up, because I asked you an important question. Jesus asked, which of these three do you think was a neighbor to the man who fell into the hands of the robbers? Well, the priest, the, the priest, he took the easiest path. Mm -hmm. He could not be bothered to go out of his way. That's that right. is true. And the Levite, he too also took the easiest path and was too busy to help the Samaritan also. Mm. But look at the path that the Samaritan took. He started way over here in Jerusalem, and then he started along to, to Jericho, but along the way, he saw the man and went out of his way to pick him up. There you go. go. Then he took him all the way over to the inn. And then, after he went to the inn, he stopped off in Jericho where he was heading in the first place. But after he went to Jericho, the Bible says he went all the way back to the inn to check on the man again and pay the innkeeper. Okay. Round to the inn. Then he went on his way back to Jerusalem. There you go. Look at that. 
Wolke did a different path that the Samaritan took. Not only did he go way out of his way, but he also used his own bandages, his own wine and oil, his own donkey, and his own money. The Samaritan sacrificed all he had to help somebody else. What a great friend and neighbor. Well, that is really an amazing path. Mm -hmm. And Jesus wants us all to be like the good Samaritan, who will put the needs of a hurt man before his own needs. That is true. Now, you kids, remember that, all right? When you see someone in need, don't be afraid to go out of your way to help them, because that's what we call loving your neighbor as... Thank you very much. Very good. That's true, Wyoming. And it's also part of our campus code. Uh, when I was a winner, since you've been away and we missed you so much, why don't you read today's campus code? I'd love to. Why don't we all stand up on our feet, raise our white hand, and recite our campus code one last time together. I, I will, will love, love God with all my heart. heart. I, I will, will love, love my neighbor, neighbor as, as myself. myself. I will be a light wherever I go. Awesome. Well, stay on your feet. This is our last time together here at Camp Venture. And I'd like to thank Rosa Window, my helper. And I'd like to thank our special guest, the donkey. And I'd like to thank my old friend, Wyoming. And one more round of applause for our four volunteers. They did such a great job. Very nice. Very good. Now, Miss Mary Wee is going to come up and read us in the camp song one last time. And I think we have a special conductor on board, don't I we? think we do have a special conductor. Is there a Jonathan in the house Jonathan, who brought his daily way? Here, come Jonathan. on up here, buddy. Jonathan in the conductor. Very good. Yes. Jonathan is dressed for the occasion, as you will come. see. Oh. But you know, there, kids, we have not one, but two animals to add to the song this week. Wow. Last week, our special creature was, who remembers? The piglet. Well, what does a piglet do? Ooh, that's so, a lot of piggies. Oh, that's a great look for Ooh. me and everybody. Ooh, All right, so we have the piglet, and then this week, our creature feature was the Wyoming's donkey. pet. Mm -hmm. The donkey. The donkey. And donkeys have really long ears, so hold both your hands up and flip those really long ears. Okay, well, I think we've got the creatures down. Mm -hmm. Let's get to our new verse. Keep going. I spied a donkey galloping by. Donkey? Jumped on the train, let out a cry, and a donkey goes, hee haw! Yeah, just like you hear. Hee haw! If you hear a cry, don't pass on by. All, All aboard, aboard, give love a try. The donkey is here to lead the way. Awesome. Yee -haw. All, right. All right, are you guys ready to do okay. this? Let's do it. Well, I think, we I think we can do raiser, this. Don't we? Really? Oh, you're right. We do need to raise that flag. Oh, it's already up there. All right, we're All righty. I think, because this is the last weekend of camp, last we week. shouldn't start slow. We should just go straight to super speed. What Silver do you think? Silver bass. Silver bass. You All ready? Right. Take it All away, right. Jonathan. Can you get it going? Got to pull that. Ch 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 